Hi there. So today we're going to be looking at how to add images to our table view. So this is our app so far. We've got uh, the table with two sections, fruits and color fruits. And we're going to add these little images to the side of the name. Okay. So let's have a look at how we do that. This is actually pretty easy. So the first thing that you want to do is you want to go to main.storyboard and you want to um, select the cell that you've created. So if this is hidden like this, you probably want to open it up and you want to select not the table view but the actual cell and then under style instead of custom you want to go to subtitle and what this does is you'll see that it changes things up here it goes so it was custom once i click subtitle it adds a title a subtitle and it gives you this option for an image so the next video i'll show you what to do with subtitles but in this video i'm going to show you what to do with images and here you could select an image that you want to put in now, of course, I've done this, but I haven't shown you. I've actually gone into the assets and I've included a few images here that I'm going to be using. Um, so you guys all know how to do that. Just drag the images that you want into this folder, the assets.xc assets. Uh, if I go back here and I select my cell, and let's say I want to put an image. Let's say I want to put the lime image. It's selected. I want to put the lime image. It shows up here, and as soon as I run my app, and it should run now and you should see the lime image all right pretty simple except there's a problem we've got the lime image for every single um, heading here and we don't want that we want different images for different headings so how do we do that well let me show you you go into your um, view controller swift and we what we want to create here is we want to create an array of images. So that's pretty easy. So I'm going to say um, let, and I'm going to call my array. Um, I'm not sure I'm going to call it um, my images, I guess. And this will be an array. Sorry, just give me a second here. Um, this will be an array of UI images. Okay. And we will populate the uh, images here. So instead of strings, it'll be images. And my images are green apple and orange and watermelon and uh, pineapple. I have the names uh, memorized here. These are this is what I named the actual file name, the image file name. Um, so if you had named the images something else, you'd have to type that in. Okay. So I've got my six images here. In an array called my images great now what we have to do here is we have to go into the uh, cell for row at and you see how we're calling up my fruit index dot section dot um, index path which is essentially the names here the strings I'm gonna go ahead and press return here and I'm gonna add one more line so I'm gonna say my cell dot instead of text label because obviously a text table a text label holds a string we want image view um, and this question mark here you just put in there um, I'll explain that in a different video this is um, uh, this is uh, for optionals so watch my optionals video if you want to understand what that is so my cell dot image view dot image and then equal and then my array name which we called it my images and I'm gonna say um, index path dot row row and essentially what I'm saying is go to this array here my images and go to the index path uh, um, and go through every single image and apply the images to the um, actual um, table so if you go ahead and run the app now if you go ahead and run the app you'll see that it should work perfect so you've got apple orange watermelon pineapple, lemon, lime, and then it repeats again here because I didn't have different images for it, but it repeats again for the second section. The subtitles are obviously called subtitles, but we'll change that in the next video. Thanks for watching.